Hey there guys, Submidian here and welcome back to Star Revenge 6. Last time we unlocked a couple of things, including the Vanish Cap, and this time we're going back into the Vanish Cap stage, which seems like a full level. If I can just get into the painting here. Whoops. Uh, I need to go in here at 5 or 6. Star 5 or 6, so... Whoops. Let's go back in. Ow. Rude. Let's go. We're heading to the Vanish Cap stage, which I forgot the name of. And see if we can't get some more stars in there. I don't know if it's like an actual stage that also has the Vanish Cap, like, incorporated into it. And you need to come back later and there's like a different entrance to the stage because it's possible that that is the case or it could be that this is the main entrance to the stage and I just need to do it better so what direction do I need to go is my question I think I went this way last time but I can't think of anywhere else any other way to go so I guess I'll just keep going this way. See if I can note. Uh oh. See if I can notice. Whoops! That is not the right way to go. Ow. Um. Is this going to kill me? No. Where on earth am I? Oh, I know. This is the pit full of plants that I need to kill. Right. That seems like it would make sense. How, can you kill these guys with kicks? You can. I'm almost dead, which is unfortunate, but these guys drop coins, so I should be fine. This is called, yeah, Pit Full of Plants. So, once I kill all these plants, it will spawn a star, right? That's how it works in, uh, Tall Tall World. Or Tall Small World. Yeah, there we go. Alright. I don't know how you're supposed to get to this place, but I made it here. Here we go! Here we go. Whoops, uh... That's not gonna work, is it? Oh, it does work. That's... never mind. Dangerous Snake Path is the name of this one. So how was I supposed to get there? Other than falling to my doom. So many questions, not many answers. This white stuff is quicksand, right? Yep. We are learning things. Hmm. Alright. It would help if it was, like, more noticeable that this stuff was quicksand. I mean, once you know it's quicksand, it's easy to avoid it, but still. Okay, there's a star there. How do I get up there? Probably I need to wait until I can get a, the uh, wing cap. Because they mentioned something about a wing cap in one of the signs. Doesn't look like it didn't do anything there either. Take this moment to look around. So down there is the way you're supposed to go to the vanish cap switch. Which I've already pressed. Whoops. I think just going this way is the way you need to go. I want these coins, man. Gotta get them coins. Eventually I will need to get the 100 coin star here. 
It might actually be rather difficult. So this is where I ended up last time. Let's follow this path and see where this takes us. It's quite a lot of blue coins. So I suppose a hundred coin star will be rather easy on this stage. Am I dead? I might be dead. I can't think of a way to get out of here. Unless there's like a war pit in somewhere. Oh ho! So that looks like a place that I need the wing cap. So now that I'm down here, am I just dead? Is there no way out? I'm going into suspicious places looking for teleports, but I think I might just be dead. Okay, I'm, I, I assume I'm just dead. I'm going to go under this. No. Alright. Rest in pepperonis. Back in we go. Need to find a dangerous star path. Whoops. That was stupid. I am the dumb. Now, when it says snake path, is it the path that snakes, or are there snakes on the path? I don't want you. Because if there are snakes on the path, that seems terrible. I would like to avoid that. No! Fuck! Back down here again! There's got to be a way out of here, right? Probably like a wing cap or something down here. God damn it. Oh, I'm about to lose all my lives. That's not good. I mean, I guess it doesn't matter because game overs don't do shit other than waste your time, but still rather annoying. I like how I managed to do this part flawlessly my first time on the stage, and now I'm having a lot of difficulty with it. It's because I'm out of practice. I haven't played in a few days. Uh oh. How did I get across this one? Not like that, but it worked. I am the master of movement. go up here now. Where am I going next? Up there, okay. So let's see, where does this lead us? Oh, I see. That's quite the series of jumps. Okay, I guess I'm trying this kill this guy first so he doesn't bother me. And this leads to a star, I'd assume. This is troublesome. Oh boy. Oh my, that's that's tricky. That's very tricky. How am I going to deal with that? 
Hmm. It looks cool. Oh boy. The game's getting progressively more difficult, which is fun. I love when difficulty gets progressively more difficult. Whoops. Holy crap, how did I manage to salvage that? I'm the best. Is this like a teleport? What are these bushes? They look suspicious. Okay, so... That way is tricky. Let's go this way first and see where this leads us. What are we doing up here? Okay, there's a star in there. Which I think I need the Vanish Cap to get, it looks like. Is there a Vanish Cap switch around here somewhere? Maybe. Oh, there's one over there. That's beautiful. Is this only to get... Oh my god. Oh, there's not... There's no game over screen? What's up with that bullshit? I want a cool custom game over screen with Luigi. Man. Oh, back in we go. I like this level. Princess Peach's castle is fucked. This is a really well done hack. Like, extremely well done. I may not agree with some of the balance issues, but that's, like, subjective. I think it's objective that it's very well designed for a Mario 64 hack. It's got a lot of cool custom stuff. The castle looks neat. Well, back in we go. Some of this stuff seems like it is designed for save states, but again, I can't assume these things, and I'm not going to use them. Unless I get extremely frustrated, in which case I might. Close one... So which of these things seems less difficult? This way... Actually, this is a way I haven't gone yet. Let's go down here. See where this leads us. That was annoying. Okay, I'm getting glitched into walls and shit. That's good difficulty right there. Okay. No. Bad. Bad ba -bomb. This isn't a ramp that makes you slide. Oh, good. Fire. I like fire. Especially when my camera angle's all funky. Oh, fuck you! I'm back down here. Nothing to do but to kill myself. That's fucking dirty, man. I should try to see if I can look at that from a distance to see what the pattern is.
because if I know the pattern, I can avoid it. So that is where I was, but I can't see it from this distance. Beautiful. Nice camera angle, please. Now nope, I'm gonna die again. It's not even instant death either. You need to kill yourself. That's annoying. There's probably a teleporter somewhere, but it's unlikely that I'm going to find it. That's probably the dangerous snake path, the, the uh, place that I just fell from a couple of lives ago. I fuck. I did that again! Why did I do that again? That's not a thing that I should do. That's an easy thing to avoid. At least I'm dying this time. Death seems more fitting a punishment than not death. At least this is a more permanent punishment. Remember when I said the 100 coins for this place is probably going to be easy? I think I changed my mind. It's probably going to be really hard. Because a lot of things equal instant death. I might come back when I have the... That fire actually helped more than it hurt. I might wait to come back until I have the wing cap. That might make it a lot easier. No, 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 no. Bad. Bad bomb. Bad ba bomb. The X button on my PS3 controller is starting to stick again. That's rather annoying. Okay, let's kill the bomb first. Hello? and then see if we can't have a look at the pattern on this. So it looks like I'm safe for most of the right side. And then the far left side I am also safe. So if I can avoid getting fucked by the fire, and then just be patient... Okay, the camera is not cooperating right now. Okay, that's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. As long as I don't die, which I might because of this thing. Okay, there's some coins here, good. No, stop it! You stop it right now. Oh my god. You, enemy, give me life. I would like your coin, please. Alright, so that was most likely the dangerous snake path that I was advertised about. Yep. What's next? Rotating Vanish Cap Fun. And I'm pretty sure I know where to go for this one, too. Oh, -ho, fun times. Let's see if I can do it. I'm either going to do it or I'm going to game over. Either seems to be a good stopping point for the episode. Yeah. That was a weird angle. Whoa! Why did I do that? Okay. So I believe this is what I need to do for the rotating vanish cap fun. Fun in this circumstance is subjective. 
but I'll give it my best. So I need... it's this is another timed thing. So I need to get the Vanish Cap. Okay, that Vanish Cap is going into the ether. Because I'm waiting for it to respawn. Let's go! Gotta go fast. Oh my god, I was actually pretty close. This is doable. This isn't that bad, I just need to stop uh, wasting time. I can waste all my time here if I want. Whoops. Oh, there I'm dead. But I can do this. Got a couple more tries before I game over. It's very possible that I can do it. Not a huge fan of timed things like this. Whoops. Um. God damn it. No, oh, well. That's just my personal opinion on difficulty. probably different from other people's, because if it wasn't for timed things like this, a lot of the game would probably be really easy. Nice uh, long jump there, Luigi. You done good, my friend. You done good. How did I manage to do that? Well, ripping pepperonis. Nope, I guess that's going to do it for today's episode. Didn't get a ton done, but this level's kind of difficult, so I guess that's only fair. Next time, we're going to do it again. Try to finish it this time. See you guys then.